What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. I hope you're having an amazing day. And today's video, we're going to take a look at app update for the Samsung Notes, which is a part of One UI 8 upgrade. And if you just take a look at the app, this is the older one. UI wise, there is just pretty much nothing. As you can see, the functionality underneath has been improved, but UI is pretty much same. So no new major upgrade as we already got one with One UI 7. So let's just go ahead and update it to the latest version. So directly like that. And I'm pretty late to make this video. This happened like four days ago, but still the app hasn't been made available onto the Galaxy App Store or the Google Play Store. So you can just directly update the app like this and it's not API restrictive. So if you have the support for Samsung Notes, you can just directly install and update the app. But going through the menus and stuff, the Samsung Share Notes is still in beta, which is weird. But let's just create a note. And as you can see, the toolbar is up top for some reason. You can just again, hold and drag it down just like before and the UI is pretty colorful than before as you can see if you just go to the right you can now customize the toolbar now unlike the Samsung internet toolbar or the Samsung keyboard toolbar you can't just drag around you have to actually select list wise on what you would like right over here this can't be changed as far as I know yeah just like that you can customize it or reset it right away Going back typing wise, you have new feature called map solver. So if you have just some random sum, maybe multiply and then just type equal, it will automatically solve the sum for you, which is something I guess borrowed from iOS or even third party apps had it. Then coming more to the typing, you have sticky note. You can just jot down your normal notes. Maybe if you're writing an article or a recipe, you can just quickly type a sticky note, go back, just minimize it like that, drag it around. It's quite hard to touch it. It's really small, but you can also resize it. Select the background color, which is pretty neat. Oh, even the clip changes, which is nice. Just minimize it right away. Now coming to more stuff, as you can see, few of the toggles have been changed right over here, such as the share node is a now expanded menu. Now you should notice, inverter collaborator is missing, cause now it's been merged with share as a single node. So you can just share a link or choose the context which you want to collaborate with. So that's now been merged. If you just go here, edit cover. Previously, you only had text and it's normal presets like the colors and the stickers, but now you have Beautiful pre-made covers by Samsung. Default one is done. If you just have a toggle previously right over here, you can just select them. You don't get to choose the colors of them, but by default, they are pretty nice. And yeah, guys, that's pretty much it for the Samsung Notes One UI 8 upgrade. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you found this helpful, please drop a like and subscribe down there for more app updates like this. And see you guys in the next one.